to three Jews trying to avoid paying for a check. <laughs> Damn, this is an expensive one, Sean. Let's just say they each got the pastrami. They did, though. That is not a joke. They each got the pastrami sandwich. You're 100% right. It's a very popular dish. So let's return right down to the table where the waiter is returning with the bill. Mm. The waiter could hand me a bill because I would sleep with him for money. <laughs> oh, that's fantastic, Allison. The bill is set on the table. The tension is in the air. All three men see it. I can just explode with excitement. Well, don't make a mess on this table, Sean. You're not the boss of me, Allison. <laughs> OK. No movement just yet. Which Jew? Ish, Jewish person? <laughs> Which Jewish person will make the first move? Whoa! Oh, it seems to be Nick. That's right, the birthright bad boy is reaching <laughs> past the bill and for his drink, and it seems like he will be sipping on that for a while. Diabolical. <laughs> Absolutely. There's Justin, your father's orthopedist. <laughs> reaching into his pocket, maybe for his credit card. Is he the, the charitable one of the group? But um, oh, it appears that it is just a used <laughs> tissue to blow his nose. Disgusting. <laughs> and Jackson, making his first move of the game, standing up, brushing the crumbs off, and it appears he is going to be making his way <laughs> to the bathroom. Did you know his bar mitzvah was Jackson themed? Oh, I did not. What a douche. <laughs> what a douche indeed. We can see Nick working on that drink, but uh, from this angle, it doesn't look like it is going in his mouth at all. In fact, it is missing his lips, pouring onto his neck. He is pretty wet, Sean, but who would it be with a waiter like that running around? Oh, Allison, you gotta keep it in your pants. And I'll keep him in my pants. Oh, okay then. Oh. Justin looking down onto his tissue and uh, he seems to be distracting Nick. It is enough to get Nick distracted from his drink. What do you see there, Allison? It looks as if Justin Oh yes, wants Nick to sniff the mucus inside of his tissue. Absolutely no logic here. That but, um, smell must have been foul. Absolutely. Nick's you know what, Sean, I can see why they're all virgins. <laughs> oh, hey? Jewish, Allison. Not virgins, uh, Jewish. <laughs> oh, and Jackson is now appearing from the bathroom where it seems he could not have buttoned his pants in the facility. He took it outside. He has stopped to talk to the waiter. And from our angle at this table, it appears that uh, he is telling the waiter some sort of Jewish joke. <laughs> the waiter does not seem to find it funny in the least, and I cannot say I am surprised, Sean. Absolutely not. And he stumbles back to the table where uh, things are getting interesting here. Nick is having some kind of epiphany or a uh, moment. It looks as if he's now squinting, squinting just into the air, calculating <laughs> something. Couldn't be the bill because no one's opened it. <laughs> but uh, now he's staring at his hands uh, as if uh, he's having an existential crisis. It does seem as if he has no idea where he is or what his purpose is on Earth. <laughs> Jackson seated back on the table, Justin making an interesting move here, continuing to work on the crumbs of that pastrami sandwich. And one must ask, how hungry is Justin to be eating those crumbs when the meal's already over? Well, Sean, I too am hungry. God, would I nibble on that waiter's undergarment! Hello! <laughs> Allison! You've got issues. <laughs> <laughs> that I do, that I do, Sean. It does seem as if Justin is maybe challenging Jackson in a very odd, potentially sexual manner. Are you feeling this? Right you are. I can see the seductive eyes within Justin staring deep into Jackson. And also, it seems that Nick is rather <laughs> jealous of the interaction happening <laughs> right beside him. <laughs> he, he oh, oh. Oh, and, and it seems that uh, maybe Justin uh, 
<laughs> chewed on his sandwich a little too hard because now it appears he's choking on on those crumbs. They are lodged in his throat and he seems to be struggling to breathe at the table. Sweet baby Moses, Nick and Jackson have no idea how to do CPR. They're hand motioning very Jew-like. Can I say that? <laughs> I'll allow it, but you are totally right. They're trying to decide who is gonna help their friend, but honestly, there is nothing, no conclusion, and Justin is choking to death only inches away from them. Sean, if they don't do anything, he will die. Nick is insisting Jackson call someone. Jackson insisting he cannot get his hands dirty. Am I misreading this? He just returned from the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> and Sean, Justin is now dead. <laughs> well, you know what that means? I cannot believe my eyes. Nick or Jackson will have to pick up this bill. Can you believe it? You're absolutely right. From three competitors to two. This is getting even more intense than we can imagine. This is game day, baby. Game day! And the waiter making his way back, it seems. What are they gonna do with the body of their dead friend lying in the middle of the table? <laughs> Nick has hoisted up the corpse of his dead friend. And <laughs> it appears the waiter has offered to take a picture of the trio, unaware that the body, the lifeless body of Justin, <laughs> is in between these two men. And it's a real weekend at Bernie's type moment. Well, Sean, you know whose corpse I would bang? Waiter, <laughs> am I right? Allison cannot be saying this on the air. Okay, all right. Well, with the waiter gone and their friend back on the table, what are these men gonna do next? Honestly, it does seem as if they've come to some sort of very weird epiphany. I can't entirely describe what exactly is going on here other than maybe Finger dancing? I've never seen a connection so strong like this, but Jackson is now reaching into the pockets of Justin. Could this be that he is, oh, he is, he has pulled out Justin's credit card and it seems that they are gonna put the entire bill on Justin. Their dead friend. Unbelievable, it's truly disturbing the lack of emotional attachment they do have Absolutely. to their good old friend Justin. And not only that, they are ordering another round of <laughs> drinks on Justin's card. An unbelievable move, and frankly, I feel dirty right now. <laughs> well, the Jews will do that to you. Jim. Whoa! Okay. Uh, but that's all the time we have for our non-kosher sports today. I'm Mateo Guacamole, Ricardo Guacamole. <laughs> and I'm... Hop for that waiter. Good night. <laughs> 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 Jewish? <laughs> <laughs>